Welcome back everyone, my name is Adrian and I'm super excited today, allow me to explain why. So back around the start of this channel, I played a game called Hylix. It was a very surreal, trippy game made using digitized claymation in RPG Maker. It was one of the most unique and amazing experiences I've ever had playing an indie game. Very artistic, very weird, trippy, surreal, nonsensical, randomly generated texts, odd looking creatures. And while that game was fairly short, I had an amazing time playing it. I absolutely loved every second of it. For the last couple years, I've been waiting because Hylix 2 was in development and I was very excited for it. All the development updates and blog posts by Mason Lindroth, the creator of Hylix, for Hylix 2 were really interesting looking to me and I really wanted to play the game so bad I was really worried that the game may not actually come out, but after about a year or so, the game has finally come out. So today, I'm going to be playing Hylix 2. I'm assuming this might be a bit longer of an experience, I'm not 100% sure, but I'm ready to get into this either way, it does not matter to me how long this is. I am super excited. Anyway, let's get into this and lo no load a, a new game, a new, load a new game. Oh, hello, I should probably put my headphones on. So yeah, this is what we have to look forward to, everyone. Very trippy, very surreal. And here I am, default controls, jump is space bar, uh, the menu is Q, view and customize controls in the options menu. Okay, we're gonna jump. Ha ha, here I am. So already, the one thing I noticed, oh my God. Oh my God, this is so amazing. All right, uh, how do I accept enter? Change appearance. I can change my appearance? What? Oh, I can switch between, you know, I'm gonna go with the blue. Yeah, I like this, I like this. So I'm gonna open up the menu and see garbs, things. Mini crystal. If you become trapped, use this to return to a prior spawn point. Okay, sounds good. How do I go back? Oh, okay, I'm gonna bump up the resolution and try to go full screen. I hope that didn't mess anything up. All right, sorry, I had to get all my settings in order. Uh, let's exit. No, no, I'm staying in the game. I meant exit the menu, okay. So, already just looking at this game, it runs so much better. It looks so much better, even though the first one looked amazing as it was. But there's even stuff like this chair that you can like move around and it moves, moves so smoothly in the environment. Oh God, that is, it's the little things like that that make this, I, I'm just so excited to play this. I'm so excited to play this, okay. Maybe talk to this guy? Oh, I could pet him. He's a little lemon headed moon crescent head like me. That's nice. Oh, hello. Back when the accretion hit, the strongest gesture was buried. I do have to let you guys know that there is randomly generated text, I believe also in this game, there was in the first game. So the text is gonna be very weird and wonky and interesting, very strange. What do you have to say? I heard that uh, TVs bestow the techniques of gestural combat. Okay, so this is where I get some upgrades and stuff. Oh my God, look at this. Oh, look at this. It looks so good. Learned Promer Bleb. Okay, I don't know what that is, but I learned it. Let's go get this coin. Yeah, I, I just love how different it is. The other one was similar, but it was like a straight up 2D environment the whole time, I believe. This looks like it actually has like almost 3D aspects to it. So I'm gonna get this coin. There seems to be a lot of places that we can go in my own house. So let's go up here. What does the bathtub do again? I forget. He became clean. Oh yeah, I think that uh, restores like my health and stuff like that. Even when you step in the bathtub, you can see the feet submerged in the water. It seems like there's a lot more detail to this game. What is this toilet? Found one soul sponge. Nice, I needed that, I think. Can I jump in the toilet? No, I can only stand upon me. All right, let's continue. I'm already loving this. I love how it controls. I love how it looks. Everything about this is really cool. Oh, there's more of my friends here. All right, I didn't know there were more of me. Pools with fountains are linked to the afterlife. From there, you may return to any such pool you've previously entered. Oh, okay. And I'm going in this pool? Oh. It put me somewhere. I don't know where I am. Hello. Gonna pet you real quick. 
Nice. All right, so how do I run? Is there a way I can figure out how to run? Let's check the controls so I can see what, run is Z, okay. Dodge is C, slap is X. Zoom out, oh, I can zoom out and in? Oh, so I figured it out. Um, Let's see if I can run, oh yeah, and dodge. Oh yeah, and X was slap, right? <laughs> Oh, dude. Oh, dude. I just, I love it. I love it. All right. Can I dodge while jumping? Okay. There's no dash. I don't think unless let me double check. I'm sorry. I just want to get all the controls under control. All right. So I don't think there's a dash function. Oh, I can toggle it. Nice. Okay. So I'm going to use the run as my default just so I don't have to keep holding the buttons and I can zoom out and in. Oh, yes. I can zoom out and then regular and zoom in and then regular. Nice. Okay, we're going to keep it like this for now. I like how fast I move when I run. There are a lot of these little guys here. Who are you? Talk to you. These Wayne larvas have just emerged. They'll be sent onto the house when their carapaces harden up. So it doesn't seem like there is randomly generated text. It's locked. Okay, what is this? Do I have to go up and talk to you? You found burrito. Oh, I found a burrito. What's going on? Oh, no. What's going on with this guy? I found meat. Oh, no. I don't know if I feel okay with that. All right. Let's maybe not. Oh, God. I'm drowning. Let's maybe not drown. Yeah, this, this plays super. Oh, super nicely. It controls super smoothly. I love, I love, love, love what you've done with this game, Mason. I don't think you'll even see me playing it, but I don't care. It's like a fever dream that I never want to end. That's, that's what I'm calling it. Okay, I can just only pet these guys. Uh, let's go up this way and see what this has to offer. Oh God, oh God. I gotta move a little slower, but I don't want to stop running. What do you have to say? Clean means respite from bad statuses for a little while. Please go ahead. But I already cleaned myself. Okay, I'm clean anyway. Let's go up this way. What is... Oh, here we go. Is this a TV? One meat tendered. Maximum flesh increased by one. Oh, nice. What do you have to say? Hey, I'm using this one. Find your own. <laughs> well, okay. I, I can't take it. All right, so I think I've done everything I can here. Oh, no. There's more over here. Who are you? Are you gonna like select a des select a destination? Um, maybe not quite yet. Can I? Oh, I guess I'm kind of. Oh, I see. So this is just where I go if I want to fast travel. I see. And then what about? Oh God. Okay, maybe I should have stayed up there. I'm an idiot. God, just look at how cool this is, man. This is like unmatched coolness. All right, let's get into the meat and potatoes of the game. Let's submerge myself in this. I'm gonna pause for a second. Is there any way to save? Oh yes, here we go, I'm gonna save. Because I noticed something fishy going on with potentially the recording. So let me uh, let me exit the game real quick and see if, see if I messed something up. All right, so we're good, we're back in it. Nothing happened, I'm okay, everything is all right. Let's get out of here maybe? What, ooh, what are these? These look important. I found juice. I found cookie. I found empty. Okay, let's, uh, let's leave. Oh wait, yeah, I have to go upstairs to leave, don't I? What about these? Can't do anything with these. All right, so I think I've explored this house to the full ex fullest extent. Let's, uh, let's get out of here. Oh my god. How many of you are there? By holding down the jump button, one may slow the descent after many years of training, of course. Oh, I see. Okay, that's cool. So it's giving me, like, a nice tutorial. Start combats with a timely slap uh, to gain a brief will boost. Oh, okay. Let's try that. <laughs> Alright, there we go. And these, these guys are showing me how to roll. I already know how to do that. This is the tutorial area, it seems. Very much enjoying this so far. Very much enjoying this. Let's zoom out a little bit. So I can get a better view of what's going on in this world. Oh, there's some secrets up there. How do I get up there? There's gotta be a way. There's a gold coin. Oh, who is that? Am I allowed over there? It's gotta be way up. Oh yeah, this has to be it. Here we go. Nice. Okay. 
Getting some secrets, getting some secrets, getting some secrets, even though these aren't very secret. What's in this room? Oh, this is my room. Okay. It's another entrance and exit. All right, let's go up and talk to this guy. I don't know who you are, what you have to offer me, but hopefully something. Hello? The stars forecast the flourishing of prescribed gestures. Gibby's agents work to reconstitute, reconstitute their master. Proceed west and seek our ally, Blairall, that he might be forewarned. Alas, the others haven't completed their training, so you will go alone. Okay, that sounds good to me. Is there any way I can get up there? No, it doesn't seem like it quite yet. Maybe I have to get like a double jump or something like that. I'll work my way back here. I just kind of want to get into the meat of the game. So it, he said to go west, right? Is that a possibility from where I am? All right, I guess I'm going to go west. Oh yeah, here we go. And here we are. Oh my God, dude. I love this so much. I already love this and I just started the game. Oh, this is beautiful. Are you somebody I have to fight? <laughs> I can't slap you, so let's talk to you. Those who possess new pneumatophore may cross the sea north to view Axe's edifice. But I don't have to go north quite yet, so I'm gonna go west. Oh no! Please do not! Oh, what did I- oh, okay. <laughs> I'm alive now, so I guess I can't fall in the ocean here. Let's go continue west. Hope to God I don't fall in any crevices like I did. Oh, see, this is like grass right here. Yeah, there's a lot more detail in, oh God. There's a lot more detail in this game than there was in the first. Oh God, I have to be very careful. The controls are a little bit difficult to get used to. Oh, who knew that just traversing was gonna be difficult? I did, because I suck at everything I try, everything I attempt turns to shit. Oh God. All right, let me, oh, oh, okay. All right, this is a little bit, a little bit tough to get used to the movement, but it's fine, it's fine. Now, is this where I have to go? Am I going way too far? All right, I'm in here. Uh, I'm gonna expand a little bit just to, oh, are these monsters? Initiative, oh, okay, yeah, I have to fight now. Um, Galliform attacks, oh no. What the hell, bro? Oh, I'm getting the crap beat out of me. Okay, I died. <laughs> All right, so I'm starting off back over here. Um, oh. All right, so I'm gonna go west again. Um, I think there's actually an objective in the start menu, so. Seek Blairol and New Moldal to the west. Okay, so where I went, I don't think that was where I was supposed to go. I think it's the first building over here oh shoot this must be it because those enemies were way too hard in the other area and i should not try to do that right now okay i'm somewhere god this is gorgeous man this game is just overall gorgeous definitely a huge step up from the original which was already really good looking Everything about this is amazing to me. All right, um, now I have to submerge myself in here, right? I hope, because then that might give me a fast travel option. I don't know. Do I have an option now? I have to talk to this guy. Oh yeah, here we go, new moldal. Nice, now I have a fast travel option. That's nice. So I'm wondering if I have to submerge myself or if it automatic, ooh, hello. <laughs> These are some weird looking things. Oh, I'm zooming out again. I want to get a full picture of this. Hello, sir. Welcome to Moldol. Behold the splendor. I am beholding it very much so. All right, let's go get this coin. The movement is taking a little bit of getting used to. But uh, overall, I'm, I'm enjoying this. All right. This seems like an entrance over here. Dropping down. All right, let's try not to fall in the hole quite yet. Let's get these and then... Found a stem cell, oh my god. And then a cupcake, nice! I'm getting a lot of stuff here. Uh, what do you have to say? Um... Oh, I can buy stuff. Oh, okay. Let's get a burrito. And another, just for good measure, okay. Nice! So this is like a shop then. There's a coin behind here. I'm gonna get... 
Oh no. Okay, I'm good. What do you have to say? It all comes down to thoughtful use of comestibles. I don't really know what that word means, but if you mean pool, if you meet pool man, burning is effective. Burning. Oh, is that like foreshadowing something? Ah, uh, whatever. All right, I'm going out. This is the shop. I have to remember that because I'll definitely have to come back here at some point. Can I go in here? Oh, nice. Okay, what else does this place have to offer me? Going over here, there's a lot of weird looking citizens. Can I enter this? It's locked, okay. Is this the dude I have to talk to in order to unlock it? Hello, sir. They're doing that big excavation in the southwest. I tried to get a closer look, but was savagely whomped by galliforms. That's not good. I'm getting this coin. All right, I gotta zoom in for this part. Ah, uh, ooh, e, oh. Here we go. Nice, I got a coin. Uh, I don't really trust going that way right now, so I'm not gonna do that quite yet. Ooh, look at this statue, bro. This is so cool. Who are you? Are you the guy I have to talk to? Long ago, Lord Gib Gibbalus wisely ruled this land. That prosperous era was cut short by wretched anarchists. Oh, that must be Gibby. Hello? Welcome to Molduel. Behold the splendor. I already talked to you. Who's this guy? Long neck ass. It all happened so suddenly. View Axe's troops abducted the cafe owner. Without coffee, we'll be defenseless against spores. Okay, I'm dropping down here. Again, I don't know why. You can't do anything for me, can you? Neither can this. All right, let's go down. All right, now I'm down. What is this? That seems like a pass pathway. Uh, this is locked, so I'll have to figure something out with that. And I'm tangled now. Oh, here we go. Okay. Let's go talk to you. What do you have to say? Calthamite husbandry brought us prosperity, but also made us a target for opportunists like Vuax. I don't know. I don't. I don't know, man. I don't know what to tell you. An impassable force field surrounds Odaz Odazir's fortress. I'd wager they've set up a worm remotely for the purpose. It's how I'd do it. I don't know what any of this stuff means, but it's okay. Do you have any words for me? Slapping bugs is a great way to restore your fresh and flesh and will. Try it out sometime. Oh, okay. Oh. I kind of feel bad doing that. All right, I got some coinage here. What do you have to say? Did I already talk to you? Heat me, oh son. <laughs> right, I'm dropping down here, seeing what this is all about. Oh. Oh my god. Hello? The fronds are obviously valuable, but it's important to trim them anyway so you don't get poolmen. I, I, this is, again, like a fever dream that I never want to escape. When hylithems are frondos, the harvest time's upon us. Guy's singing a little jaunty tune. Hello? Sometimes we find them too late and then you just have to tear them out before they turn bad. You hate to see that. You hate to see it. Oh, there's more over here. Hello? Glove lathing, burrito synthesis, all starts with hylithems. Find a rich vein, translates to a lot of bones. A lot of bones. So can I do that? Because bones are currency. Oh, that's blocked off. So I'm assuming that at some point later on in the game, I'm going to be able to come back here and do more stuff. What do you have to say? Oh, I'm fighting now. All right. I'm already being attacked. I have to really make thing. Really make sure. Oh, no, 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 no. How do I go back? Uh, gesture. Let's do dissolution on this guy. Oh god, yes, dude. Oh, I'm probably going to die here. Yeah, I'm going to die. Let's eat a burrito. I'm a little concerned because I'm probably going to die. Oh, okay. Um Let's get another gesture going. Let's do this, and go for this guy, maybe? That is not doing nearly enough damage. 
Oh, he phoned in a friend? Oh my god. Oh no, this is bad. I don't have much will left either. Let's do dissolution again and get this guy. Okay, he went down a little bit. Oh, he disappeared. Oh no, please. Okay, I need another burrito. Let's eat that. Does graft. Oh no. Oh no, he just regained health. Ah! Oh! Alright, let's do this to this guy. What did that do? Uh, what is going on? I'm vulnerable now. Oh no. Oh no. I died. Oh god, dude. Oh. Alright, I'm back here. God, that sucks. I gotta make sure I don't go down there then. Until I'm a little bit better off in terms of capability of fighting. Because as it stands, I don't think I have the proper abilities to actually make a difference when I fight people. All right, let's drop it. Oh no. Okay, let's select where I go first. New Muldol. We're going down. All right, note to self, no fighting until I'm a little more ready to fight. So let me just go find this guy that I have to talk to because I'm wasting a lot of time here. Ooh, a banana. Oh, I kind of want that. How do I get that? I gotta do some climbing first. Maybe I gotta go in here. Oh, hello. Dedismon. Oh, I remember you. How's it going? No, no, I am small dude den day. Dedismon went north across the ocean chasing rumors of active cabinets. Oh, I thought I was gonna have a buddy. Dedismon, or however you pronounce his name, was my friend before that I was able to bring along with me to fight. As our meditations turned more practical, bodies became largely superfluous. <laughs> okay, so you turned into a amorphous blob. When the accretion buried the sage's great ship, Disflarn Moon, my wife and I, were stranded here on the surface. Well, that's no good. Oh God, no! I thought I was about to fall into the abyss. How do I get this coin? Is that even possible? Oh, I have to fall from there, don't I? All right. Um, so how do I get there? Let's drop down. Let's see what this is. I found boots. Oh, that means I can equip them. Okay, let's equip them in garbs and put boots on. Nice. So that gives me more flesh and more speed. All right. Nice. Okay. Yeah, I have a little bit more flesh. All right, let's climb back up. Speed, I don't think applies to my actual running speed. I think it applies to um, fights. All right, so there must be another way, another place I can go to allow myself to get up top. Aha! What is this? This door is locked from inside, okay. Realistically, I just want to find this guy so I can end the episode, but let's quickly get that banana that I saw up there. Again, I don't know why, but I'm gonna. Oh, crap. Yeah, movement is definitely not easy in this game. It takes a lot of getting used to. All right, I'm gonna, tr oh God, come on. Let me get that banana. Crap, this is really difficult. I'm gonna zoom in for this. Oh, not that close. I really want that banana, man. I, I, that's like one of the main things I want right now. Okay, I don't know if it's happening right now, man. I can't spend too much more time on this frickin' banana, so... I'm just gonna go do the objective, because I'm wasting so much time right now. Alright, I assume this is where I have to go, I think. No? Yes? Oh, we have some guards here. I knew Vuax would betray us, villainous slug. Chief Blairall is, uh, not in at the moment. I'm afraid, oh, feel free to go in. What the heck? What? Why? I'm going in anyway. Screw you guys. Hello. Sir Pongorma, what brings you to New Muldul? The tricushion chair lies vacant. Lord Blairall has been abducted, taken north to view Axe's ed edifice. Big Wayne sends prescribed gestures and sent me to warn Blairall. He must be recovered. Just so. And I've sourced fresh 
pneumatophores to facilitate our journey. I trust you need no instruction in their usage. I think they went over this at the Wayne House. Give me that. I forget. You may regard the pneumatophore in your inventory to see a control summary. Oh, okay. Oh yeah, I got Pongormo with me. Yeah, finally. I got a, a, a buddy to come along with me. Nice. Let's slap these bugs. Let's see if maybe there's a TV in here that I can gain new abilities with. Hello? None may enter the treasure room so long as I remain here. Oh, okay. I guess not. All right, we're going to get out of here. Pongorma, come along with me. There you are. Uh, let me double check what that thing is that I just got. Options. All right, well, I don't know how to jump dash. Oh, okay. Oh. Nice. All right, let's slap this guy. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave this episode off here. I have another objective now, and that's to proceed north to view Axe's edifice. So, as it stands, I'm super excited to get into more of this. This, oh, this game is going to be really cool. I know I didn't achieve much in this first part, but uh, I'm just too busy exploring the area and just loving every little aspect of this game so i'm going to continue this in the next episode thank you all so much for watching i'm going to leave a link to this down below it can be found on itch.io uh, but i bought it on steam it's on sale now so if you guys want to pick it up i highly recommend doing it as soon as possible but that's going to do it for today thanks everyone for watching hope you enjoyed be sure to hit that like button if you did don't be afraid to leave me a comment as well and if you enjoy my videos please feel free to subscribe i upload a video every single day of the week thanks again for watching everyone and i can't wait to see you all in the next video take it easy